Hello from Penny's Kitchen. So tonight I've got some Brussels sprouts and I just trimmed them with a small paring knife. And now we're gonna put them in the rapid prep mandolin and we're gonna do some very thin slicing. So I'm gonna turn our mandolin to just the slicing function. Let me spin this all the way around. And I'm gonna do them pretty thin. Let's see, I think I'm gonna do them on two. That is two millimeters. And let's get rocking and rolling. So I want them really thin because I want them to saute very, very quickly. And we're just about done. And slicing the Brussels sprouts yourself gives you a lot more control. And of course, it's a lot more economical. Also for food safety, you're starting out with a whole vegetable, which is always better than buying something that is already cut and can spoil more easily. Okay, so I've heated up the pan and I have to add just a little bit more oil to this. And this um, oil and vinegar dispenser allows you to really um, determine how much oil um, you're getting in there. And what I'm gonna do is I have some roasted garlic. Um, slow roasted garlic that I am going to add and I'm going to smash down. So this is, roasted garlic is very, very mellow. It's not bitter and I love it because I'm just going to infuse it in this oil. Oh yeah, I'm going to make it nice and garlicky because I have a lot of Brussels sprouts. I'm going to just smash this down. Oh, this is great. I'm going to add my Brussels sprouts. And I'm going to saute them around until they're just still crunchy, but a little bit softer. So these are cooking down nicely, and the roasted garlic is infusing and smelling wonderful. I'm just going to add some fresh cracked pepper to this and some um, fresh pink Himalayan salt. Very flavorful. And toss this around a little bit. And then I'm going to take our piece of halibut, and what I'm going to do is I want to sear the skin side, so I'm going to place it in the pan. And what's really nice about this, this is our non-stick stainless pan. It's a wok, but it has a very nice flat bottom. So when I want to do something where you are searing the skin, I'm going to bring the temperature up a little bit more so the skin gets nice and seared. And while we're doing that, I'm going to take a little bit of olive oil and just drizzle that on. And then we're going to take our chimichurri seasoning and put our chimichurri seasoning, sprinkle it. We're going to sprinkle it out all across the top and wait for that skin to sear. Okay, so our skin is beautifully seared and I'm going to place it right on top of all the rest of the Brussels sprouts. I'm going to turn this down now because I don't want the bottom of the Brussels sprouts to burn. And I just want to create some steam now, cover the top, and have the halibut cook through. So this should be all done. It looks wonderful. And about a medium cook through, medium well. And that's really how we like it because it's going to cook a little bit more on the plate. So let's tilt this up and show you. That's our steamed halibut with sauteed Brussels sprouts. 